hi everyone welcome back to my channel don't forget to click on subscribe in this video we create an angular app and integrate with django rest api so we must have node.js and npm installed in our system before starting angular i have already installed node and npm check note this and npm in your machine by this command ok our machine is ready to install and run angular 10 application now we have to install angular cli latest version with this command so we can take help from official documentation and now click on get started for local setup and here installing the angular cli using this command and then create a new application by this command ng and new my app so before creating new application you need to check your angular version okay and then navigate to your angular application by cd command and then start build in server of angular by this command ng serve dash dash open okay i have already created this application so here and now open to terminal for two different application so select python interpreter python and select activated and down here two terminal one for angular and one for django now navigate to angular application by cd command and start server by this command ng serve and hit enter now open browser and a new tab okay now 
go to app component html and see and edit this angular 10 and API path system save and see Now go to backend and set a root URL with welcome view. We can create this view inside a new application name public. So go to backend by cd command. and now create a new application python manage start app public Now navigate to public and then view, create an index view in inside views of public application. So create a class index view. we must implement here api view we can copy this from accounts so copy paste here and change profile view to indexed view remove this welcome to full stack development ok now create a new file inside public URLs and now copy accounts URL to public URL and change accounts with public and here root and change profile with index ok 
okay save and go to root url and add public url so this is root url add public url And now we need to add public application settings installed app. So public dot, dot apps dot public config save and now start server and now browse root url this is publicly accessible log we are accessing this root without login so now proxy config the angular app to backend server here backend server is Django REST API server So open Angular documentation and here go to this link ok and follow this create a new file inside angular project source create new file and add this inside this file change port with your Django REST API port and now add proxy config to angular.json angular and source architect build option serve and here browser target and now run 
development server and the serve already server is running now create a service to access data from backend server by this command so it's open a new terminal navigate to front end and then create a server by this create a service by this command ng g s services then public this command create a directory service send a public service class inside itself and now navigate to service and open public service we need to http client module and http client to communicate with the backend server over http protocols so we need to import http client module to root app module go to app module and now import http client module from angular common http http client module add this to imports Now we can inject the HTTP client service as a dependency of an Angular application class. Here public service class. So go to public service class and now import HTTP client from angular common http and inject here private http http client okay now initialize the backend root url here with a property api url root url must be Django or REST API root URL okay now public service can fetch data from backend server using HTTP client dot get method now create a method get message and this method return data who is faced by http client dot get method so return this dot http 
dot get and then use this root URL here actually this URL the root URL of public application and fetch which data return the index view will come to full stack development this dot api url we can use get message method in any component using dependency injection all over the application go to root component here root component app dot component dot ts now create constructor method and ng on init method Okay. And create a property M S G O is return any type of data. And import public service here. Import from services public service I inject into constructor private service okay now create a method to fetch data to show on template so create a method name show message and initialize this method from ng on init this dot show message first ng on init initialize this method and then invoke show message from ng on init and now this dot p service dot get method message and subscribe data
this msg call data see the output from console ok now reload browser to go to console access the data reload inspect and now click on console and disconnected now reload access block by course so we need to install course headers package and do some configuration on backend server so go back to backend server root url now in ensure virtual environment is activated and now install course header copy this and now hit enter follow this documentation copy course headers app and add it to backend settings installed apps ok and now copy this line and add this top of the common middle layer and copy this course allowed origin don't need to this documentation now and add these lines anywhere change this port with angular application port is running and now delete this and now reload angular application ok angular and django rest api connected properly 
प्लीज वॉच द नेक्स्ट वीडियो थैंक यू सो मच